Hi, Ron Price back with you with Greg Allen behind the camera. Greg's the executive director of San Juan Safe Community. So glad to be filming here for this installment of CPR. And again, we're still into the holiday season. We talked a little bit about that last week. I want to share with you a couple of things Items from my book, Play Nice in Your Sandbox at Work. We've covered these before, but it's been a while. I want to share with you two of the tips to prevent conflict with family, friends, loved ones, church members, association members, total strangers for that matter. The P in the Play Nice model is to push the pause button. If you know you're getting ready to go to a gathering where there's going to be that aunt, that uncle, that cousin, that whatever, who, who irritates you. They just, they just get on your nerves. And you're not supposed to admit it, I know that, but most of us have that one person who can just get us. My recommendation is going to be before you go in that door and greet everybody, choose your attitude in advance. Choose that you're going to keep your cool, that you know what they're going to do, but you're not going to let yourself get all upset and cause a scene. You're going to be better able to blow it off if you've chosen your attitude, if you have pushed the pause button. The other one I want to share with you is the A from the play nice in your sandbox model. The A is assume good intent. Now there are going to be people in your life who are, they're, they're going to irritate you, they're going to do you wrong. They're going to say something or do something or, or not say what they should say, not do what they should do, whatever, it doesn't matter. They're going to irritate you. Now, you're only choice is not is not how to get them to stop that but well that's a different subject we can talk about that another time your choice is how you're going to respond or react and my recommendation is that you practice the a assume good intent again if people care about you they're, they're not going out of their way to mess with you they don't wake up in the morning and say oh how can i ruin their day today they're just being human so when people do those things rather than get all upset and, and attack back just assume that they probably didn't mean it. Maybe they're having a bad day. Maybe they said something inadvertently. You can keep a little thing a little thing if you respond with kindness, with whatever it takes to not let yourself get all bent out of shape. Again, holidays are wonderful times. They're also ripe for conflict and disagreement and ugliness that some families have been so broken by they don't talk to each other for decades. Don't let that happen to you. Push the pause button before you go into that setting. Choose the attitude you're going to bring in and assume good intent. The people who will disappoint you, let you down, they probably didn't mean to. I think you'll have a happier holiday. I sure hope so.